Hey guys, it's Donna Fisher, the owner of FBH Wellness, and every Sunday at 7, it used to be 7 a.m., but now we're doing p.m. during the pandemic, and we made it through another week. I'm so proud of everybody. So we just wanted to say thank you for joining us last week on all our Zoom classes and um, mentally and physically um, staying strong with us. We're so proud of you, and I cannot wait to see you. We're almost there, hanging there. So today I'm with my um, client and, and friend, and most of you know her, drum roll, da -da 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 -da! Emily, she's going to teach us the four cornerstones, and this is going to be so fun. I can't wait to hear about this. Okay, Emily, they're tired of hearing my voice, so All take right. it away. So my name is Emily, I know most of you guys, but nice to see you on, is this Facebook or Instagram? Yeah, both. Both, good to see you. <laughs> so Donna asked me to share with you some of the skin health tips that um, are my go-to. And when I look at skin care and when patients ask me questions, I feel like the best way to summarize it is the four cornerstones of skin health. With the most important thing being sunscreen. When you're looking at a sunscreen, you want SPF of at least 30. And really a mineral-based sunscreen is gonna be better than a chemical-based sunscreen. So you really wanna look for products that have zinc and titanium. Those are gonna actually block and deflect sunlight versus trap, chemical sunscreens will trap the heat in your skin and actually flare conditions like rosacea and things like that. So first cornerstone, SPF. The second one is gonna be a retinol. This is, there are some over-the-counter retinols, but a lot of them are gonna be prescriptions. Retinols e increase the desquamation of your skin cells, which means skin cell turnover, um, which by, by causing more skin cell turnover, you stimulate collagen. So who doesn't want more collagen? So Yay. my top two products, retinol and SPF, the other two cornerstones are gonna be antioxidants and growth factors or peptides. So antioxidants actually protect your skin from free radicals in the environment. That's going to be a vitamin C. Um, and vitamin C can also help your sunscreen work better. So that's something that you use in the morning. And then the last cornerstone is either growth factors or peptides. Those basically work on the extracellular matrix to rebuild the structure of your skin. And we have science to back this up. So we can look um, all of the way to the dermis and look at the structure of your skin and peptides rebuilding that which gravity and sun exposure damage over time in turn can really help the tone and texture of your skin. So that's what I try to do on a daily basis. Those are my four go-to things. If you have any questions, you know where to find me. Oh, that was way better than <laughs> listening to my voice. So what did I have to bribe you with to get you to do this video tonight? Um, I told her I wanted to do the Cadillac not the reformer. <laughs> okay, we're working out on the Cadillac. You guys have a great night. We are signing off. This is Donna Fisher, Sun at 7, and I will see you next week. Guys, keep those masks on, wash your hands, and we care about you so much, and we cannot wait to see you back in the studio very soon. All right, signing off.